All right, AVC, how you doing? My name is uh, Jamie. Thanks so much for stopping by. Uh, as promised on the last one, we do have another unboxing for you, and this again is celebrating a 50th uh, anniversary. Uh, this album came out in the UK late 1968, uh, early 1969 in the US, and uh, it is a great one. It's The Kinks Are the Village Green Preservation Society, and this is what they've got in the outside cardboard box. So I have taken it out of the box. I'm not fumbling with it, but I think I'm going to try to hang on to that. So yeah, the Kinks are the Village Green Preservation Society. And uh, just opened up the shrink just a little bit, so I'm not fumbling too much with it, but I can show you what this looks like here. And there you go. And we got this on the back, uh, this paper insert on the back, but on the front we've got the hype sticker. Uh, the Kinks are the Village Green Preservation Society 50th Anniversary Super Deluxe Box Set, uh, expanded edition of the Kinks celebrated 1968 masterpiece. Hardback book, extensive new liner notes, essays, unseen photos, and interviews with Ray Davies, Dave Davies, and McAvery. 2LP heavyweight vinyl of original gatefold album, so new stereo and mono remasters. Also original Swedish 12-track LP heavyweight vinyl, new stereo remaster. Five CDs remastered original albums, singles, B-sides, previously unreleased tracks, demos, live, alternate versions and mixes. Three reproduced 7-inch picture sleeve singles, reproduced memorabilia, and audio remastered from HD Masters. Alright, so we'll slip this off here. Again, so I'm not fumbling with it too much for you, wasting your time. And then it is the paper uh, sleeve that's just on the back there. And I'll just read you the uh, back here. It says, uh, Somewhat overlooked upon its release in November 1968, the Kinks of the Village Green Preservation Society is now seen as one of the best British albums ever recorded. Created in difficult circumstances by a band who refused to follow fashion, it is an album of timeless, perfectly crafted songs about growing up and growing old and the decline of national culture and traditional ways. Enduring and unsurpassed with its wit, sadness, quiet anger, regret, and Charm. It is generally considered the high point of the Kinks' outstanding career and Ray Davies' masterpiece. A calm, nostalgic album which feels like a sweet, hazy dream, but with endless layers of musical and lyrical innovation, the Village Green Preservation Society's defiantly British sensibilities became the foundation for generations of British guitar pop. There you go. That pretty much says it all. Uh, certainly an album when first released, I don't think it uh, did all that well on the charts. It's since become a favorite. It's uh, now included in Rolling Stones, a top 500 albums of all time. So that's the paper insert that just goes on the back. And then so now we have it like that. Okay, let's open it up and see what's inside. So first thing that's coming out is the uh, hardcover book. The uh, Kinks are the Village Green Preservation Society in Pictures and Words. So this is a nice big uh, LP size book and I'll see what I can get it. Flip through a couple of uh, pages here. Don't know if you can hear the wind howling outside but it has been a windy week and today uh, quite windy as well. But the Kinks, what a great band. Sometimes they get uh, sidelined with the Rolling Stones, the Who, the Beatles, etc. But uh, what a great band. And as you can see, some essays, stuff going on, vintage photos. Colorful artwork there, certainly. And certainly Pete Townsend was a big, big fan of the Kinks and certainly of... Uh, Ray Davies writing, and I think uh, this album in particular, Pete Townsend is a big fan of it, uh, calling it uh, the Kinks, uh, Sergeant Peppers, uh, if you will. See, okay, lots of artwork there, some singles, and okay, so that is a look at the book that's inside. All right, let's take a look at the album itself. This is the Kinks, or the Village Green Preservation Society. Now, this was a gatefold, and so then they've included. Uh, this is a 2LP set, but basically the stereo and mono versions. There you have the back. Opens up like that. And we'll take a look at what the vinyl looks like. Now we'll put the vinyl. And uh, yeah, initially on the Pi label, so they've kind of recreated that there. So this is the stereo one. And see if there's any difference in the mono one. 
obviously the sound difference, but let's see if there's any label difference. Uh, for the mono one. Nope, looks exactly the same. Okay, so there's that. Slip that back in. Okay, so there's that. And then we have... Uh, this was supposed to be like the Swedish version, I believe is what it says on the back here. So this is the original 1968 Swedish 12-track LP. Uh, 180 gram heavyweight vinyl original artwork includes Days and Mr. Songbird not on the above. So there you have uh, Mr. Songbird and Days that are just not included on the previous. And on the pie label. Okay, so there is that. And then we should probably have a CD or two in here, I'm assuming. All right, and then the rest of it's housed in something like this. Looks like there's some... And it just opens up like this. Let's see. Hopefully nothing's going to pop out here. <laughs> okay, so you've got... House like this. We'll take a quick look at what's inside these uh, like little jackets here. My goodness. Okay, and then you've got the CDs housed like that at the back. But then each one has got some extra little things inside. So we'll see if we can... Take a look at the first one. Okay, my goodness. I don't know if we're going to run out of time for this one. So this one opens up like that. Okay. And they've just popped in like the CD booklet like that uh, inside as well. That's rather odd <laughs> to do that. The, the, yeah, there's no CD in this one. Obviously the CDs are in the back, but they've just popped the the, the booklet in like that. And so you have... And some press release postcards kind of thing. And lots of photos included. This is, oh, looks like a, oh, just a little mini poster there. And oh my goodness, even the, you know, the old song sheets that you could pick up. That sort of thing. I think we've looked at everything. And this is, this is oh, oh, and another bigger poster. Okay. So there's that one, and that was just in the first folder. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see what else we can find here. Okay, so we'll pop open the, the second folder. And this looks like it's, unless I'm missing something, so this has one of the singles housed inside. And it just pops out like that. So this is Days, and she's got everything. That was in the second one. Yeah, interesting, interesting way to do this. Okay, let's find out what's in the third. I'm assuming in the other singles. So here we have Starstruck and Picture Book. And again on the Pi label. So there's that. Those two, and then we yeah, we should have another single in there. And so we've got uh, the Village Green Preservation Society, and then Do You Remember Walter? How's like that? Okay, so there's that. And then I don't know if there's anything else. It seems to be uh, everything that's in the folders, and then as I mentioned, with the uh, all the CDs housed in the back here. Yeah, but it's interesting how they just pop the uh, CD <laughs> booklet uh, just in one of the uh, the uh, folders there. Okay, so that I think is pretty much it, unless I'm missing something that's been tucked away. But uh, certainly looking forward to uh, perusing this and certainly getting into this. Uh, the Kinks are the Village Green Preservation Society from 1968. This amazing 
uh, super deluxe uh, box set. And uh, again, interesting, of all the Kinks albums, that uh, this one is getting the big uh, box set um, edition, but I'm sure there'll be other ones down the road as well. But uh, yeah, it looks great. All right, and uh, certainly look forward to your comments, and uh, thank you uh, so much for uh, watching and listening. And uh, again, leave a comment or two if you can, and uh, certainly subscribe too. All right, we'll chat again real soon. Take care, bye-bye.